Hello, everyone. It's Phil Jones from Projective Reviews, and joining me is Mia Shin from ViewSonic. And today we're going to be talking about new projectors and ViewSonic's direction and all of their new offerings, including laser as well as the growth of LED. So, Mia, how are you? Good. Perfect. Nice to, uh, to see you again and to share some great new products we're going to have. But before we get started, we'd like to thank our sponsors, AV Pro and Meridio, for helping us put on this fall's projection showcase where we talk about the latest projectors and things that you need to develop and build a great projection system. But today, we're going to be talking to Mia about ViewSonic. Now, Mia, um, ViewSonic offers a wide range of projectors, but there seems to be more and more of your lineup is focused on LED and laser. So can you talk about why? Definitely. So we do see there's a strong trend for going toward lamp free because, you know, lamp, uh, you, you're going to have more limited lifespan versus it's not good for the environment. So mm -hmm. um, lamp free, that's definitely the uh, the trend. And we're noticing not only they need a high brightness laser lamp free solution, they also need something like LED projectors with better color saturation and also uh, better suited for just a home theater environment. So we do dedicate it to launch more new um, and the better, brighter lamp-free projectors. Yes, so so like I said, there's benefits to both LED and laser, which is why they offer two different types. So, um, so right now, I guess brightness is, if you need something that's really, 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 really bright, that may be leading towards a laser. If you're looking for something that's really energy efficient, as well as, um, delivers great color. That's where those um, multi, you know, um, red RGB type um, LEDs seem to stand out. But the big thing too is the life of the bulb, because that that matters whether you're in a business environment or whether you're in a um, consumer environment. Correct? Definitely. So I think that's another huge benefit benefit especially you know giving the uh you know the energy bills is getting more and more um unbearable so with mm -hmm. gold lamp free that's another um benefit so um basically if you're talking about lamp it's probably around um uh 10, 000, um hours and uh, it should be probably eco mode so not at a full brightness mode but for led you have up to 30,000 hours of lifespan and the laser is about 20,000 um, hours of lifespan. So while it make it easier for you to understand to translate into, for example, you use four hours a day, your LED projectors can last longer than 20 years and the laser can last for about 13 years during the lifespan. You need to worry about you know buying a replacement lamp or having somebody to help you change the lamps so that's mm -hmm. really the benefit make it easier toward the whole uh, lifespan of your ownership of the projectors exactly and that really matters in a business environment where these projectors are used eight hours a day five days a week you could really burn through those hours really rapidly so as an IT person or facilities person this having the um, the benefits of longer life is a big thing. Um, as well as if you look at a consumer, I'm a consumer, and back in the days, I've always had bold projectors, and I am moving now towards solid state. Another benefit that we that we always talk about is how fast they turn on. We kind of put that kind of a um, don't really make a big deal of that, but anybody who's ever had a lamp based projector, when you hit the switch, it takes forever for yeah. that um, for it to warm up. And, and turn on. And also when you turn it off, it takes forever for the uh, for it to turn off because it's trying to ex um, make sure that you don't extend the life of the bulb, right? Right. Right. So, so it's an on and off. That's definitely another benefit um, from the solid state technology because it's now lamp. It's uh, solid state. Mm -hmm. So it, you, you, you're going to enjoy that um, just like, you know, your TV or any other devices in your home. When you turn it on, immediately you have what you want. So first, let's talk a little bit about your offerings uh, in LED when it comes to consumer projectors. So let's talk a little bit about the X1 and X2. So can you give me a little information about this bomb? So we have the regular throw X1 and the show throw X2. So it really depends on the size of uh, the room you want to use these projectors in. But yeah, we have two options for you. 
Yeah, which is great. Um, when they talk about the different lenses, I always think of it this way. Regular throw, a lot of times those projectors are sitting behind you. You know, short throw, think of it as sitting on the coffee table. Exactly. So right. if your room means that you really kind of have to have the projector in front of you, not, I mean, like, and, and um, a few feet from the project, from the, from the screen, a short throw piece is a great one. And if it's going to be kind of behind you or above you projecting, that's where the regular throw comes in. So, so that's, that's really, really nice. And I like the fact that it has vertical lens shift, which re really helps you align it to your screen as well as really good horizontal and vertical keystoning. Now, we were talking about color, and, and you mentioned that an LED, which is RGB at least, normally has a wider color reproduction, correct? Right, definitely. That's a, the true benefits of LED. So, and also because of the this uh, features of LED, so human eyes perceive LED brightness better. So even mm -hmm. though when it comes to NC lumens, um, they're probably probably not as bright as uh, lamp based projectors. But uh, you, because of the h higher uh, color saturation level, your eyes will feel it's brighter. So for mm -hmm. like home theater, um, X1, X2, th those are pretty bright for uh, most of the environments you're going to use in. Okay, so richer, more vibrant color, um, more colors you can reproduce. And then last but not least, because we're using, um, it because it's a, a LED, I mean, it's because it's an LED and it's RGB, right. LED, there's no color, the, the, the need of a color wheel. Um, is reduced, which which eliminates um, rainbowing, which some exactly. people may notice when they look at a DLP projector. Right. So lots and lots of benefits. You know, again, 30,000 hours of lifespan and also, well, audio uh, performance, that's another thing we try to deliver in one single box. So it mm -hmm. also comes with Harman Kardon speakers and both of these two uh, projectors, they are also Wi-Fi enabled. So make it easier mm -hmm. for you, uh, you know, to connect. It's a very compact, um, projector has great sound for its size and it's a great product for someone who wants to permanently mount it or maybe um, you take it from um, dorm room to dorm room uh, space to space so it's small enough to actually do that while still deliver a, a massive amount of brightness right. so right. it's a really really cool piece and this piece of course is full hd or 1080p which is which is more than enough for many many people now for those who want even more um, portability but still want really, really high performance, that's where the X11 comes in, right? Definitely. So X11 is the um, uh, we, you know, I, I think we we had the X10 for KE uh, mm -hmm. feature that in your previous summit. So X11, that's the latest. Uh, uh, addition to our portable 4K family. So the improvement on the X11 4K is not only size, but also uh, it's quieter because we do, you know, when you try to enhance the um, audio performance, you not only, you know, you're going to have good speakers, but also you need to have really low noise level, plus the size and also um, it's getting more updated feature um, with more easier setup, um, auto focus uh, features to make you, um, you know, easier for you to put it like any angle or any um, places in your room mm -hmm. to enjoy. Okay, is it still bright? What's the brightness on it? So this one, um, the brightness is um, still um, around. For NC lumens, it's still about a 1,000 NC lumens. But in when you translate to LED lumens, it's about 2,400 LED lumens. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So it's still bright, more than bright enough for a um, to utilize in a media room or like in a bedroom or a lot of times because of its um, capabilities outside. And it also has an upgraded sound system, right? Yeah, definitely. Harman Kardon speakers again. So that's um, um, comes with the Harman Kardon custom A watt speakers. So you don't need to connect to you know additional um, speakers just to enjoy the whole theater level experience at home or anywhere because it's affordable. That the design is really, really nice. I, I love the form factor. It's one of, one of the prettiest kind of portables that's out there with the little cover as well as the handle. So it's easier to transport from, from space to space. Um, it's just a really, really beautifully designed product and it's still a pretty short throw. So, you, so it's still kind of designed to be, you know, like I said, on that coffee table in front of you. And it's a lot easier to get a big image um, without having to have the projector way 
in in the back of right. the room. Right. Moving on from that, you still offer some laser pieces. And yeah. one piece is something like the um, X2000B, uh, which we reviewed and we thought was a very, very good piece. So can you talk a little bit about this model? Yeah, so um, this is kind of like a laser TV. Um, you're going to notice that um, a strong uh, demand and uh, trend for uh, ultra short projector to be used as an alternative TV. So X2000B, that's definitely uh, for this kind of purpose um, because it's ultra short So to get a hundred inches image, you only need a nine uh, inches uh, projection distance. So it's pretty close to the wall. Um, that make it a lot easier for a lot of people for a lot of settings. Uh, uh, to enjoy. Um, it's going to project a much larger image than what you could possibly get at this price point from a flat panel TV. It's a lot easier to bring a screen or, um, and a laser for TV up to a, your um, fourth floor walk-up New York apartment than trying to get a 100-inch flat panel up there. You have the ability to use wall, the wall as well. So you can use a screen, you can use a wall. It's a lot easier to have that big, large image with this projector. And also, it's 2,000 um, NC lumens, solid performance mm -hmm. from laser uh, uh, light source. It's designed to be a TV replacement. So, of course, it's got to have the same lifespan as a flat panel. Laser, that gives you that. So, and plus, mm -hmm. again, common cotton speakers. You know, you, you also want a good sound system in your, you know, regardless of your uh, bedroom or uh, home theater or uh, living room, you might need to have another set of great speakers, expensive speakers. But this one comes with great DB support, um, mm -hmm. audio, and also Bluetooth in and out. So when you don't want to use a projector, this project can be used as a Bluetooth speakers as well. So it's like very multitasking. Yeah, and then what I like about it is you can use it as a Bluetooth speaker. It has good sound for your um, watching your movies because it supports like Dolby Audio and DTS and all that type of stuff. But the other thing too is sometimes you want to watch a movie without disturbing others. Right. And not only does it have a Bluetooth receiver, it also has a Bluetooth transmitter. So if you have a pair of Bluetooth headphones and you want to watch a movie in your bedroom or in, in the living room without disturbing others or waking others up, you can put on a pair of headphones, you can have your big image, the rest of the family can go to bed, right. and they will not hear anything. So I think this is, the fact it has a receiver and a transmitter really makes this piece incredibly flexible. So I think that's cool. All right, um, last but not least, for I, uh, during my day job, I actually do a lot of audio. So sometimes while this has a great sound system, there are people like me that have full blown, you know, multi-thousand dollar sound systems and this ensures that what is connected to the projector will be sent to the your sound system in high quality audio so you can have multi-channel surround sound. So really, really um, well thought out piece of media. I like it a lot. One thing that can be kind of challenging when you try to set up a projector can be it's um, getting it square on your wall. So you guys have a feature for that, right? Yeah, definitely. So we have the four corner adjustment. So that's, um, you know, you'll be able to adjust um, even uh, if you're, uh, um, you know, the, the surface you're going to project um, your image on is not flat. There's something the projector can automatically help you to uh, overcome that issue. So it mm -hmm. just make a we understand that sometimes projector can be intimidating to a lot of people. So we try to make sure the whole, um, you know, setup experience is as, as easy as you, you are using your TV. So that's the whole purpose of this product. Exactly. So if you, if you're using a wall and a lot of times walls are not a hundred percent flat or square, right. um, that really, this really makes sure that you still get a square image. So some other features, um, wireless mirroring, so you can cast stuff, from your phone. So you can take that little image that's on your on your tablet or phone and project it up on a larger screen. So if you want to show your TikTok videos or anything like that, you can actually do that with this projector. Uh, so how much is this model? Okay, so the, the um... 2899 so it's below um 3k i think for an alternative tv if you can get a more than uh, 150 mm -hmm. inches this is still a great piece uh and a good um you know good price per inch exactly under three thousand dollars is actually very very good um that it has when you talk about uh performance to value this piece really does stand out and like i said i was quite pleased with its picture quality um you can also check out the review of that model 
and, and many of these models on projector reviews, because I always keep asking Mia to send me new, <laughs> new models. And speaking of new models, you are launching another new model, which you're going to send me, correct? And it's sitting yeah. right in front of you, the, the M2W. So talk a little bit about this model. So we have this M2 family uh, line up. So we have M2, that's a 1080p. Um, and, and then also we have the M2E, um, that's more, um, this is the uh, M2W and then we have the M2E. M2E is smaller, but this is definitely, M2E is a good piece for, you know, um, uh, for like portable theater projectors. But for mm -hmm. but we do realize that a lot of role warriors, they have need for a brighter projectors. So when, uh, you know, this is how we got the M2W. M2W, the major improvement is on brightness. So this one is uh, up to, uh, in terms of LED lumens, it's 1,700 um, LED lumens and then it's about 700 NC lumens. So given the size, it's, you know, easy, uh, purse friendly, easy to put into your backpack or purse. And then uh, for role warriors, you can use this as a perfect um, portable meeting projector. While, you know, when you go home, you can still use this as a, like a backyard theater projector or, you know, um, just uh, take it to any party um, that would be a perfect, um, you know, projector as well, so. Yes, it's a it's a it's a really really cool piece, and and I'm looking forward to having the opportunity to review it. It's LED, so you have all the benefits of that. Another benefit of LED is low power consumption, so so that means that it's easy um, to to drive and it doesn't get as hot. It doesn't have to be as big. Doesn't have to have as heavier fans, which makes for a smaller chassis. So so it really helps its its portability. So that's good sound, right? Definitely. So this one also comes with uh, good home and carton speakers and again, Bluetooth in, Bluetooth out. So regardless, you want to use a headset um, or you want to use this as a, 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 a you know, uh, external um, a Bluetooth speaker, uh, both would work. So all the features, uh, just a more compact size, size and also good, better brightness versus our previous generation of M2 family to give you a solid um, meeting presentation performance. Yeah, and that's a big point. You can use it for both home use. So they say you're looking for something, you want to take it to a dorm room, you want to take it camping. Um, your kids want to uh, use it for movie night. You have all those capabilities. And of course, as a business tool, being able to take it to to, um, to meetings and, and and things like that means that it, and because of its brightness and stuff, it's great for both business and entertainment applications. And this piece retails for $6.99. So Mia is going to try to get me one of these um, as soon as she can, right? Yes. Okay. So um, now, I like I said, I really love this piece. Now, in addition to your um, consumer models, you also have some business models, right? Right. Definitely. Uh, the LS 500W um, family, we have also the regular throw show throw to um, so different settings. While um, we're going to have a, another new model that's, um, you know, improvement on brightness again. So we have uh, 2,000 NC lumens, 3,000 NC lumens, 3,500 NC lumens, and we're also going to have 4,000 NC lumens coming up. So basically, mm -hmm. uh, Usonic as a brand, we are very dedicated to lamp free. Mm -hmm. And uh, in mm -hmm. terms of solutions we have a strong belief in LED uh, better mm -hmm. color and a more affordable while the, uh, the size will be compact so there's just you know all the uh, benefits we mentioned earlier so that's why we're mm -hmm. continue to um, you know introduce more and more uh, new LED and lamp free solutions to both B2B okay. and B2C customers okay so so the so the LS500 and LS550 the um, it is a, a WXGA um, projector, so that's the resolution that you would see commonly in classrooms and and boardrooms for presentations and things like that. Has all the benefits we talked about in the, previously, the long life benefits, the, the the low power consumption and the high brightness that have been found on other ViewSonic LED projectors, and um, it's available in two in two models. So what's the difference between the two models, Mia? Uh, so ratio. So again, you have the standard throw. If you want to place back of the room, or you have the show throw. So uh, it's just really up to you know whatever the settings you have. Mm -hmm. So so great projector, 
lots of brightness. You're looking at 3,000 LED lumens, and it's just another example of how you can utilize a um, one of these ViewSonic projectors for both um, uh, business as well as there's applications for LED in um, in, in uh, home theater so, or homes as well. So you had mentioned there was actually a couple of other models that another model that may be coming up real soon. So can you talk a little bit about that? LS510. So that's an upgraded model of the LS500 family uh, with also enhanced brightness at 3000 NC lumens. I think that's uh, making it easier to uh, fit it in more environments. Um, again, it's LED. You have all the benefits, but you get a better in terms of brightness. Mm -hmm. And it seems like before, um, if you got a projector that was over a couple, like um, a thousand or so LED um, um, anti lumens for LED, that was amazing. But now LEDs are getting systems are getting more and more and more um, bright. So right. you're starting to see um, LED reach brightnesses that are you would only have you would normally expect to only get from a lamp or a laser. So all the benefits of LED are now being applied to projectors that are even brighter. Right. So. And we're going to have 4,000 NC lumens coming soon. So maybe in our next summit, uh, we'll have uh, we'll be able to um, show you the 4,000 NC lumens LED projectors. Okay. So so like I said, lots and lots of great um, projectors. I think the little M um, M2W is go is a great option for someone looking for a uh, a good holiday gift. And if you really want to take care of your loved ones maybe look take a look at a x um 2000 b which would be a great piece oh you have one there huh yeah i have oh, one so. So, well <laughs> the, it, it's uh it's really not that heavy so it's easy as you can see uh you can move from room to room so you know just like but tv you would never be able to do that how will you be able to move like 100 inches tv from <laughs> just not easy but with the projector easily the X2000B is a um, pretty looking unit. The, the, the fit and finish and the industrial design is very, very good. Um, um, and, and that's something that I've always known as ViewSonic. They make well, they, they build very well made projectors that are, um, their fit and finish and their, and their industrial design is very good. So if you look at the X2000Bs and the, and the M2Ws and even the X1100s, they, they look really nice and and it's something that you would like to have in your home all right mia so thank you very much for for coming and talking to us again to learn more about viewsonic's lineup of projectors be sure to check out viewsonic.com and check out our reviews of the viewsonic projectors on projectorreviews.com so mia thank you very much for coming Thank you, for, thank you so much for having me and looking forward to talk to, to you soon and showing you more exciting new products. Exactly. And I so I shall talk to you in the spring. So take care, everyone, and we will see you soon. Bye.